guys what is up this is the here back with another video and today i'm gonna be showing you guys how to create the spectrum effect in headphone 4 pro so let me show you guys what spectrum means in audio wave i created this song in my whip i got from the dealership the spectrum is right here Find the jealous like more of us, whatever don't know. And the best part of so yeah, that's the spectrum. So let's get to it. The first thing you will need to do. Yeah, so you will need to open new. And will I have my settings set as 1080p, full HD, 30 frames a second. So yeah, you just wanna click start composition and when you click on this this should pop up so you want to find a song let me see cutting mm. on our own so it's it's 3 minutes and 28 seconds so you want to click on this remove add a new composition and you want to change the time settings to your song length so my one is 3 minutes 28 seconds and I'm gonna put a hundred here in the corner and leave everything as it is. I just click OK and it should have this. And after that, you want to click New Layer and click Plane. And I want to name it Effect. And this should pop up. So you want to get a background, so I'm going on to let's type of background. And let's select this switch. And to save the image. I'm going to save it to my desktop. And after that, you should see the picture here. You just want to drag it in. And there's your picture. So you want to get your song and paste it into here. After that, I'm gonna click effect, generate audio spectrum layer only. Just drag that into effect and you should see it here. Now go to controls and click on this little tiny bar and you should see audio input, click on it, click audio layer and add your song from there. So you guys see this white line here where I'm pointing the mouse. You can change the colors like see colors, one color, I want two colors, so just drag it So two colors. After that, you just want to click here in the corner, see, see red, I see red, the second color, let's leave it as yellow, so you can adjust the thickness for my, I like my one, like, that, 
Ali Haid Haid That one So the second thing you wanna do is add your background by taking it and dragging it under it Now we should be able to stretch this open like this So let's see how it goes Okay, so it's working perfect but I'm gonna show you another way. Click on effects and type in polar app. And you should see it here. Polar app. Drag it into audio spectrum. No, drag it into effects. And you guys should see the circle. Now go to controls. Throw along until you see polar app. And you can change the rotation like this and the range. Okay, so I'm gonna change my range to this so some, it looks something like that. So you're gonna with the start radius, how big you want the circle. Like see let's go a little more bigger than that. And radios like that, so let's see how it sounds. Okay, it sounds then good, but let's raise the height a little more. So I think that's enough. So that height is perfect. So what you're gonna do is make sure you have all your settings correct in this video and you want to export the video now by so clicking export leave everything as it is on mp4 and just click export i'm going to export it to my desktop see mp4 i'm going to name it I'm gonna name it video and just click save and it will be rendering right here. And if you guys want to know how to get hit film for pro, I will comment and like this video. I'll fast forward this. So yeah, it's almost done. Let me show you guys how much this program takes of the CPU and stuff. Mine is an automatic fan speaker. I have a Core i7 Intel processor. So yeah, after it has finished, you can just click OK. Exit this card and you should see the video right here. That's how it will look like without any text. Yeah, so that's how it look without any text. So let me show you guys how to put text in the video. So open up Vegas Pro, Sony Vegas Pro. My one is open and on my second screen so I will drag it on the screen in a minute. So yeah, this is Sony Vegas. So let's drag the video into here. It should write in before. I want a lot of volume a little bit. After. Just click here so when you drag in the file and you should see this. Go to media generators titles and text and just use default text and you could type in anything like say s text and you can shrink it into the circle like that you could change the color say pop pink to change the font and stuff 
I thought it said something look like this. Oh, by the way, I will leave a link to the song in the description, and you could add more stuff from here, like say whatever you wanna add, like say stream bass, e x e e m, stream bass. You add it. Make sure it's on the timeline. Time you have to be in top here, but well, well that's it for this video and just click file, export again, I'm not gonna export it. So yeah, make sure make sure to subscribe by clicking that red subscribe button and turn on my post notifications and like this video and my recent video I will be commenting back in the first five hours when I post this video and you guys can comment back which other video do you guys want to see me do so yeah that's basically it so I will catch you guys on my next video let's play the outro Peace. That I'm at an all time.